can't believe it. I picked... Oh, hello. I picked every single bloody button. And the one that was right is the top one. You have got to be kidding me. Finally! And we see the statue basically freak out. All the tubes are now gone. I repeat, the tubes are now gone. And it starts to melt, or no, it's it's molding. Into that statue, which I don't know the name for my life. And we get this awesome cutscene of the circuit boards being reconnected. As life springs back to the computer world, and the deadly virus has been stopped thanks to Project Panic. Ah, it's pretty. And very vibrant, too. That's right, folks. A young boy named Slap and his dog named Stick have managed to get rid of the computer virus and save mankind. And what do we get as our reward? The statue telling us that everything is A-OK. -okay. Mission complete! Id. You have successfully cured the virus. But unfortunately, this moving text cannot be saved. Oh, that poor little girl. She probably thinks like the, it's going to kill her. And she likes classical music. Sure. Why not? And all the machines are returned to normal. Well, most of them. Are you kidding me? You're giving me the mostly normal crap? It gave him flowers. Alright. Everyone come out and take a bow. And cue the credits, folks. These are all the characters that were in the game, and we could have met them if we didn't spend... Wow, that's... Huh. Is that Chun-Li? Dracula and some random chick. Werewolf and some random guy. Zombie soldier and some chick. That thing. A caveman and a shark. Peter Pan and the crocodile. That's not right! A sumo wrestler and a steam engine. Uh, an explorer and a biplane. A secret agent versus his adoring fans. A samurai versus a kissing lips. The crying babies. Cop on motorcycle. Cop car from, I guess, Streets of Rage. Ambulance. Fire truck. Fireman. Alright! So, yeah, this was Panic, folks. A really enjoyable game that, well, is completely screwed up beyond all reasoning. I can't believe I managed to get that in one sitting. One freaking sitting! Can you believe the endurance I had to have to sit through this, pardon my French, batshit insane game? Really, I need to, like, I guess curl up in a padded cell or something to make sure I don't fucking freaking hurt myself after playing this straight. Holy hell, that was... Well, that was fun, but... Huh, Jackrabbit Slim. And the Terminator Hula Dancer. But, yeah, this is a really rare and uh, fun gym on the Sega CD. It's completely screwed up beyond everything I've ever played or seen before, but that's the cool part about it. The game takes risks and isn't afraid to be... different. Or insane. Or making the player go insane. And I'm starting to see these people in real life. I'm, I'm seeing everything. I, 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 I'm scared. 
But uh, yeah, it was because of this game I finally I finally had meaning to actually buy my Sega CD when I first bought it a couple of years back. Actually, two years back. Um, I was always debating on doing it until I saw gameplay footage of this game. I'm like, holy hell! If I can find this game, I'll buy my Sega CD right then and there. And then, of course, a day later, I go onto Amazon and I manage to find the game for about thirty. And the Sega CD with all with all its hook with its uh, with the with the uh, AC adapter for about sixty. So right then and there, I went ahead and bought this Road Avenger, the Sega CD and Sonic CD. And that was probably the best purchase I've made. It was because of that I was, I was able to complete my uh, Sega, my uh, well, my Sega Genesis uh, collection. So we're gonna try to find a Master System, but uh, so working out right now. Thank you, Adam Silvania, and the one, two voice actors for the entire game, presented by Sega Enterprise Office One. We just got done with Panic, folks. With Gase. And that wraps it up for this, uh, completely screwed up LP. I'll see you guys when my Sandy has returned to me. And we're starting off the, uh, final game before the little... We'll start the final game of the Sega CD uh, run-up uh, before the joke game. Uh, serious game is going to be Snatcher, a fantastic Kido Kojima game. That's really freaking awesome. And afterwards, we will start the insanity that is Microcosm. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>